Today is the day. What? Today's the day. I'm getting my Wookiee cookie waxed. Yeah. Mm. I'm still a little bit nervous. So what did I do? I spent a lot of my morning replacing the juice out of this juice box with some Mama Mango wine. I know what you all are going to say. Um, you know, don't drink wine. It's going to make it worse. It thins your blood. All this kind of stuff. You know what? You know what it also does? It numbs your give a shit factor. Yeah. Yeah. If anything, yeah, it might be a little bit more sore and it's going to thin my blood. But at the same time, I will have left my bag of fucks at home. And it'll definitely be a lot funnier and funner of an experience to me. This is what I'm thinking. We'll see. I've never had this. So anyways, I decided to prep. Okay. I did a lot of research. Did a lot of research. Never had my southern regions waxed before. So I prepped. I prepped. I took a little bit of, I took some scissors, did some, did some trimming. Cause look, nobody's been down there since I got married. I know. I know. So don't ju don't judge my husband. Okay. He does a lot of good stuff, but yeah, no, that is one thing he doesn't do. So nobody's really been down there. I haven't either, really, because uh, kids, that's why. Anyway, so I read somewhere that if you exfoliate first, that it is like the best prep that you can do to avoid ingrown hairs, all this kind of stuff, rashes, all that. So I did. I exfoliated. The only exfoliating stuff I had in my shower was my peppermint exfoliating uh, cream. Yeah. So I put that on. I slapped it on there real good. Exfoliated. Yeah. Even used my back brush, you know, uh, to get in there. And, uh, it didn't take very long before. Oh, that, that shit got minty. That shit got minty. It got real. It got real. It, there was that like brief moment. You know, when you like eat hot sauce or something and you got that oh shit panic moment where you can't like your whole body freezes up and you just can't you just can't you're just like that's what happened that's what happened it felt like I was skydiving with no bloody pants on so you know there's that uh that was fun <laughs> it was invigorating whoa let me just say yeah so that's what I did and then and then I just I I, I was thinking Maybe I should stick an air freshener in there, you know, just don't want to, just don't want to, you know, cause the, the girl that's doing it for me. Okay. I used to be firefighters with her a bunch of years ago. She saw me last when I was, well, a lot thinner than I am now. Okay. I'm big, bold and beautiful now. Uh, she saw me when I was in a lot better shape and I haven't seen her since. So I was like, oh, you know, I just want to be like, I don't want to be like this guy. I don't want her to be like, oh my God, what happened to y'all? And then I'll take off like my, my pants and then there's nothing landscape down there. And she'd be like, holy, holy, holy. You know, I don't want her to go through like that shock. So, so I took some scissors. I trimmed some of it up. Yep. Trimmed some of it up. Exfoliated with some mint. Then I slapped on some apricot massage oil down there make it smell good nice and fresh nice and fresh so uh i'm hoping that that's gonna be you know it's gonna be a good experience right uh i'm going to videotape well if they let me i'm gonna videotape some of my experience no you won't get to see my cha-cha darn hey yeah no cha-cha but i'll show you i'll show you yeah yeah this is just gonna be fun my legs my eyebrows, my upper lip, my mustache is going. Mm -mm. Yeah, so wish me luck. Wish me luck. Bye.